okay good morning everybody today's video is going to be just a little bit different than normal i wanted to share with you some information i found about my iphone but there was a problem that i had i only had the 16 gig so it constantly kept telling me that my storage was full i went through everything i researched everything i just couldn't find a solution to help me um clear up the space on my iphone and Obviously, <laughs> Apple doesn't make it very easy for you to clear the cache on your phone. And when I went into my individual apps, unlike my Android, I wasn't able to clear the cache in my individual apps either. Um, and when I went in, it kept saying that I had 8.9 gigs of photos space being taken up however my folder was deleted my deleted folder was deleted there were no photos on my phone um, and my iCloud was not um, updating or storing backing up my phone so lucky for me I had my OneDrive and everything I needed was saved there and also to my Verizon account everything that I needed of importance was saved there because for whatever reason on my iPhone 6 my iCloud was not being backed up properly so finally just about a month last month at the end of the month my husband found this program and it's called iFunbox and I will leave the link in the description and this App. Uh, well it's on my computer so it's not an app but this program actually allows you to clear up that space on your phone and it actually found those 89 photos for me that was taking up the 8.9 gigs of space so I was able to delete that once I deleted it I had the space on my phone that I needed and there are folders in this program that you can actually clear your application cache. So I'm just gonna show you a little bit of how I use this. So obviously I have my phone right here. Sorry for the darkness. And it's plugged up with the um, USB cable to my computer. So what I'm gonna do right now is actually go into my camera. So I'm clicking on the camera right there and this is actually two pictures that I took yesterday. So um, if I delete them, I would just go in right here and just delete those. Right now I don't want to delete them because I didn't back them up. But fortunately for me, since I deleted those 89 photos, I don't really have to worry about my space right now. So I'm just going to leave those there. But this is what you would do. You just go along here and it says right here, it's Nika's iPhone, iPhone 6, iOS 8.0.2. Um, and then you would just go in any of the apps, I mean any of these um, folders over here on the side to clear up anything that needs to be cleared up. Um, so I am going to go into the app, the user applications. And these are all of my apps that I actually have, uh, excuse me, on my phone. So let's just go into one that I use a lot, which is my Shopkicks. So I just double click that and then you have documents, library, store kit, temporary. So I'm gonna go in here and it's nothing being stored in there. So that's not really helping. That's not really, um, let's see. Oh, here we go. If you go into the library and you see it has cash, caches and cookies and you would just go into caches folder and you would just clear these two folders you would just delete these two so i'm going to go in here and delete that and of course they ask you are you sure you want to delete it and you would click okay and then you would go in here delete that folder and this is just cache so then it frees up that space that the app is taking because I use that app anytime I go into a store that participates in the app I use it and I take pictures because I'm scanning stuff to receive points and you know it just use utilizes my location services and everything so I use that app a lot and actually I have a lot of apps that I use um, on a regular basis for when I go to the grocery store and stuff like that so Basically, that's all you would do. You would just go into your user applications and it will show you all the apps that you have. And you just go in there. 
and I'll show you again. So let's try Facebook. You would go into the library folder and go in and clear up your cache. You see all of that does not need to be saved. So you would just go into there and just clear all of that out and you don't have to worry about all of that space that the app is taking up anymore and then you will have that space freed up on your iPhone. Um, I know when I was out there looking I saw a lot of people trying to figure out the same thing that I was trying to figure out and it's not easy at all to find this information on how to clear up that space on your iPhone. So I hope this tutorial helped you. If you have any questions about this program please let me know. Again I will put the description of the, I mean the, the link to this application in my description. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you wanna see more of me and my family, go ahead over and check out our personal channel. We have a lot of little things going on in our family and you can get to check that stuff out. If you wanna see more of what I have coming up in the future, just go ahead and subscribe so that you can get an email when I post something new. Again, if you have any questions on this app or any questions about anything from any of my previous videos, let me know. I will answer. Thank you for watching. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm all over the place today. There's so much going on, but I hope this helps. And um, yeah, if you have any questions, let me know and I will see you all next week. Thank you.